Oh yeah, what's up guys? Yeah, yeah, wow, yeah, wow. Yeah. Happy New Year and uh, blessed week. Okay, welcome once again to a new year. Welcome to a brand new year. Welcome to a good and prosperous year. God bless you all. Okay. Um, I want to I just want to drop a very little tips you know a very little tips on the the same lesson on how to solo the same lesson we're going on the putting in together you know so many people have been asking me different question different question on how to solo like I've tried my best to teach on how to solo so I know there are different ways there are different ways okay but I just want to throw a little piece of guidelines as well, okay, to you guys. So, um, for the sake of this video, if you know you are, in, this is the first time watching my video, yeah, my YouTube channel, your new year, I would like you to click on that subscribe button and turn the notification bell so you don't miss that any of my video each and every time I post a new video. Okay, all right. So give a comment down below. Give smash the like button if you like this video, okay? And don't worry about my camera. Like I said earlier, we're gonna get a good camera by the special girl this year. So let's get straight to the today, okay? So uh, it, today for today, I want to show you this lesson in the key of uh, G, key of D, G key of G uh. okay What are the first thing I want you to know is normally everybody when we are playing most guitarists they like playing something like this uh, chord shape like this yeah. they play their four chord like this which is a bar play their saw chord like this okay normally they play the saw chord like this some other people they play it like this Those are the basic chord. Those are the basic chord. Each and everyone we know the chord. But there's something I want to show you there. Okay, each and every time you are playing chord like that, you should try to be applying something like this. So okay. So what am I playing there? Playing from the saw, Four chord. Going to your three chord now. Okay, those are the those are the guidelines that will help you in terms of soloing. Okay, those are the basic pattern that will help you in terms of soloing. Like, uh, like what I'm playing there is just the one four five chord progression, the do fa and so. So when you start playing like that, when you start playing like that, okay, so those are the things you get your finger, you get your fingers, you get your fingers more harmonizing, okay, you get your fingers more harmonizing. Okay, so 
Second one there, and want you to know is uh, when you are playing your chord or your solo in anything, a song, okay, like that. Same two, uh, five, four, four, and uh, one, four, and five chord progression, okay. You be you should try to be playing something like this. Mm -hmm. I'm there. So, when you start playing something like that, you see your soloing, you see your fingerings, your feelings uh, will start getting harmonies with, understand, will start getting harmonies, will also uh, give you a, a good tension of sound, like a good harmonizing tone, okay? What I'm playing is me so me so and you slide it so me so me so me me so river so river va 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 la va re do la va re do la Okay, so work on those basic uh, pattern of solo in basic patterns of feelings, okay, and and you will and you will see your playing growing hard, okay. If you have any other suggestion you want, you like me to show you, you like me to play along, drop in the comment section below, okay, and we'll work together this year. Alright, thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.